your window of opportunity is a lot smaller. Farmers take time preparing for winter seasons like this, but no one was prepared for what Mother Nature had in store this year. We've been getting ready since July. 90% of the orchard could be fine, 10% could just be ravaged. The figures released showed that $441 million were lost by farmers due to the cold snap in the San Joaquin Valley. Show ya. John Glass has been farming citrus crops for over 40 years now and operates on 7,000 acres of land. He tells 23 ABC about the damage he saw firsthand. Emotionally, it's, it's, it's crazy. Financially, very, very expensive. Farmers spent $49 million in protecting their crops using everything from blankets to frost water. But the most effective was the wind machines, and they weren't cheap. At least $50 an hour to run one. And that's just one machine when you're doing hundreds of them. We'd go out early and we'd go all night. And now the moment farmers are dreading, forcing them to swallow millions of dollars due to a factor that was simply out of their hands. We work pretty much 24, 24, so just around the clock. Lemons lost $24 million, mandarins lost $150 million, but the biggest hit was navel oranges, which lost farmers $250 million. It was a hard fight, an expensive fight, but we fought and saved a lot too. Experts are sure that consumers will have to pay more for these fruits in grocery stores, but a hike in price isn't nearly enough to compensate for what these farmers lost. You could lose everything in one night, everything that you've worked all year for. It doesn't, it doesn't take but, you know, one, one hard night. Now, according to California Citrus Mutual, because of this freeze, certain fruits like mandarins and navel oranges will only last until about mid-May rather than July when the season usually extends to. So head to the grocery store sooner rather than later if you want your fresh dose of vitamin C. In studio, Lauren Ellinger, 23ABC.